Namaste guys, Ashish here from Namaste Tech and as promised we are back with another Redmi Note 4 video and this time we are talking about another feature in MIUI that's called a second space. Now if you are running MIUI on Redmi Note 3 or any other phone of MI, you should have this feature. But if you got this brand new phone, the Redmi Note 4, which is pretty awesome, you should actually start using this feature. So what is second space? Now, if you have used the Android tablet, it comes with the option where you can add more users. Now, second space is similar feature, but lets you add just one more user and it gives you a complete different setup. It, it's like having two phones on the one phone. So you get complete phone access. You get the different messages. You can have a different Google account. You can have apps separately installed on the other account. And these are two separate profiles you need to switch from one to other to access the content. Now there's some discounts here where there's a tool inbuilt in the second space which allows you to access data which is on the primary space but that's for another reason and everything can be locked down. So let's have a look at it. So go to settings and scroll a bit to find the option called a second space. As soon as you tap on this it gets into configuration screen so better ready to set it up. So like you can see, it creates two profiles. So we'll say turn on second space. Now it will obviously take storage space in terms of everything, apps, accounts, messages, everything. And it switches. So this is what basically it looks like, a complete different setup with all the pre-installed apps available, all the basic apps available. And with few more controls, for example, move data, manage, switch back to the primary, account you have got settings as well so if you open settings you get access to everything what was on your primary profile as well so we'll just go back and take a look on these things so we'll open notification because it says two things here which says go to first space so you can switch to the first space and then you can set up your second space which is the most important thing to start with so we'll tap on set up second space now there are a few things to set up First is password as well, so set it up. Now, before we get into this password thing, I'm gonna warn you that there's no way to recover a forgotten password in case of second space. If you forget your second space password, there's no way to get it back. Now, at least one thing good about this time is you get a fingerprint sensor and second space has started supporting fingerprint sensor. So you just add it so you never have to worry about pattern or password or anything else. So we'll say set second space password. So we'll create a pattern. So you cannot have the same pattern. You have to have a different pattern for the first space. So it basically gives you an option for that also. Say confirm. So second space password is done. Go to next. Now you can import your photos from the primary space. Say next. You can import your files as well. This can be done later. You can import your apps. Now, if you have seen our video of the dual apps, you already know how this feature works. So it can import the apps and make use of it. Go to next. You're all set, say okay. Now this is where all your settings are managed. Now, this is the password on and off. You can change your password. You've got second space fingerprint, which you should add like right now. I'm going to do it. All right, so I've added my second space fingerprint, so it'll be really useful. Now, there are a few things you should know. There's a notification shade shortcut. So switch between spaces from notification shade. So it's basically here. So if you want to hide it, you can just say notification shade shortcut off and it just vanishes from here. This is for your privacy. So if you don't want to tell everybody that I have a second profile, you can use that. So let's turn it on for now. Then you have notifications, so you can receive notification from first space as well. And there are times when there are apps which are important that you are using on your first space and you want the notification on your second space, you need that. Tap shortcut to switch, show private messages. Now, if you want your messages to be like stay secure, in second space you can do that. You can move data between spaces. Now there is a one for that, I'm going to do that separately, second space. Now let's take a look at the move data and I'm going to just unlock it. So you can see you have option of app settings. There you go, from the first space, second space. 
So if you tap on this, use in first space, use in second space, use in both spaces. So basically you can duplicate the apps this way. Let's go back. You can import photos, files, contacts. You can also export all these data from your second space to first space. That's way easy. Now let's go back. Now let's go to first space. Switches, pretty quick I would say. Now let's say if you forget your password and the option to delete was in the second space itself. How do you delete when you are in your first space? So option is there, just not very primary. I think it's done on purpose. So open seconds, you have option to delete here. So if you delete this, it says delete second space and it will do that. Now, instead of this, if you ever wish to delete your second space, what you should literally do is, let's switch. I'm going to use my fingerprint. There you go. That is fast. I'd rather go to manage and say the delete second space because then you get an option called as continue and I will say and it gives me an option where I can import all this stuff which was in my second space to my primary space so that I don't lose anything. So you can do that. So I'm going to just remove this, say continue, set delete all. And we are back to our primary profile. And when you come back to your second space again, it says turn on second space. So guys, that was all about second space on MIUI. There's one feature that many of you would like to use. You should know that you can use a second Google account or even the same Google account. It's almost like two different phone and you can access your data from one from second space. Like you can get your data, primary data from your first space into second space. There's an option to put fingerprint sensors so in case you forget it, this makes a lot of sense. And if you ever want to delete it, you can take up all the data back to your primary space and save it all. So that was all about second space. Guys, thanks for watching. Do subscribe to our channel for more videos on Redmi Note 4 and other phones as well. Hit the like button if you did like the video. And if you have any questions around second space, do let us know.